So we made it safely back to the home 40. I am going to take the boat, back it right in there. That way it'll be kind of in there in the shade and I can fiddle around with it. Uh, I do want to get the grass cut today, so I think that's going to be the next thing. I got an old trailer out back I want to sell. I'm going to put it by the road. And I want to bring that old tent camper out and make sure the mice didn't get in it like they did the other one. And then uh, put some peppermint things in it to keep the mice out of it. That's going to become our new our new tent camper for when we take the grandkids camping, I think. <clears throat> and then I'm going to cut the grass. And then I'm going to work on the boat. That's the plan. So since the mice ruined that pop-up camper, we've had this tent camper. This is a, I always call it a 65 Apache, 69 Apache, but somebody said it wasn't Apache, it was a something else. I don't know, there's a couple of companies that made these tent campers, and this is one or the other, I don't know. But anyway, uh, that front board was a little woggly, so I'm just gonna put a piece of plywood right on top of it, staple it down on that, take a piece of carpet, Staple that on top of that. See, this becomes your little step up. You step up into here and you go through the door here. And this thing has a tent. It's like a big A-frame that goes up. Well, there's a tent right there. We want to pull out, pull it out and make sure the mice hadn't got into it. So, so far it's looking good. That's my honey baby right there. She helped me move this and that's why it looks so pretty is because she's plum awesome. You plum awesome honey baby. You know that though, don't you? Oh, sure. Plum awesome. Oh, sure. Plum awesome. Nice and sturdy now. Yeah. Put her away now. Okay. Really lightweight, so it ain't hard to. You yeah, really, you don't have to back it up. And you could literally, if you wanted to, unhook it and push it around the campground, you know. I'm gonna put a little air in that tire, especially where we got the air hose out here.
Okay, about the only other thing I can think of that I might want to do. I know the lights work on this. I want to remember to put tag on it. And I believe I've got some small four bolt spares uh, around here somewhere. So I'll grab one of those and take with me in case we ever have a flat. Other than that, that little baby's ready to go. I tell a honey baby I might pick up a big tarp to throw over the top of that tent. There might be some leakage through the top of that tent. I think I got too much sun on my head. I gotta put a hat on when I get back. I'll pull this out back.